everything's okay. <laughs> You're doing well. Yeah. It's like that Dixie D'Amelio girl has that song, Sometimes I Don't Want to Be Happy. It's like, no. You're going to be happy <laughs> and you're going to be fucking happy now. 800,000 people a week are filing for unemployment. You're singing in a mansion. You're going to be happy or we're going to throw you in a volcano. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that we've, I don't care. I, well, money doesn't make you happy. Shut up. Like you can't release a song during a pandemic and an economic collapse and go, sometimes I don't want to be happy. It's like, you gotta, well, you gotta Bieber, be happy. Bieber, it's relatable. Bieber dropped lonely. They're relatable. Right? Well, he was writing about his life. He, he was, was writing about his life. And it's not relatable it. because I guarantee you <laughs> that you can, you know, sometimes I don't want to be happy. First of all, it's the lyrics because she's going, sometimes I don't want to be happy. So oh. sometimes I don't want to be happy. It's like, it's basically like saying, Oh, like she has it. Like she's going, she has sometimes it. I just want to be a cunt. You know, it's like <laughs> just, that's the song really. Sometimes I want to be a bitch and ruin a dinner. It's like, you have to just, I like them. I, I, I'm very, I'm pro all everyone, but <laughs> just, I just, cause in my head, in my head somewhere, I'm like, you'll, in my head, I just went, you'll never be able to collab with her now. Like, why would you, that's how sick I am. I got to get out of here. I got to go to Texas. Cause in my head, I went, you'll never be able to. I think people get it. I yeah. Think people get it. You're a comedian. Yeah. I'm a comedian. Right? They like, they're all actually the TikTok kids are actually the coolest kids in the world at laughing because they're li living these amazing lives. So like, if you make fun of them, they think it's great. Like they're actually so much cooler than like a lot of comedians I know who are super sensitive. It's weird. Right, right, right. It, it like, might it, be, yeah. it might be a generational thing. May that might I be think it. it might be. Yeah. Think about it. These kids grew up getting bullied online. Right. All yeah. of them. Yeah. Right. All of the TikTok stars. Right. Cause until you're famous, attempting to be a TikTok star is not cool. It's not cool. That's right. And I, I realized that cause they were like, yeah, I used to get beat up and bullied All for doing this. And now they're like the, Cool kids at the happened, yeah, but happened, also, happened, happened to me and Jake. That's crazy. probably right. Yeah, but right also, so, yeah. The, yeah. I bet you they. I bet you they also. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a slogan. <laughs> it's slogan. Slogan. I I bet you at the end of the day, the TikTok stars also have already come to terms with the nature of their like being yeah. on this planet. They're like, yo, I'm famous for hitting woes and bus it challenges, and it's like great. like like Dave Chappelle. Right. He deserves some fucking respect. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't yeah. talk shit to Dave Chappelle. He's a fucking legend. Right. Some of them are. But like the person on TikTok that's like, you know, I don't even know what they're doing over there. You probably right. know better than I do. Like, well, they, they I think it's a lot of dancing is what I've observed. Yeah, they've come to terms with yeah. the fact with the fact I'm, that I'm they're like not so even opposite on your guy. I'm like, yo, if you got the bag doing that, you're a winner to me. That's like, what I feel. Yeah, like, like uh, they're all we're not calling them losers. No, no, I, oh, I, feel, I thought I feel you guys like that too. You know, fuck with them. Like I, don't, I don't, I don't, I don't let. Uh, I personally don't think finance dictates any kind of like like arts, arts been you if know, they're crafty. Shit. They're crafty though because like if, at the end people of, make. The, do you see the dumbest people make? I mean, fucking redneck morons make hundreds of millions of dollars. That doesn't make me respect them any fucking more. <laughs>